Hey guys, Anna Austin here to let you know that I have a new single coming out this Friday, October 9th called The Sound of Heaven. Now, I know some of you are thinking, wait, didn't she release a song called The Sound of Heaven before? Yes, I did. In 2016, I wrote The Sound of Heaven and recorded it and released it on my first EP, um, December of that year. That EP has since been taken down, which is a story by itself for another day. But I wanted to make sure that this song, The Sound of Heaven, still had a place in this world. That it was still available to you guys to listen to and to worship to. So I am re-releasing it this Friday, October 9th, and I couldn't be more excited. This is my creative space. Yes, this is my bedroom where I write the majority of my music. And this is where I penned the lyrics to The Sound of Heaven back in 2016. I woke up one night from a very vivid dream I'd had about heaven. It's the heaven that's described in Revelation chapter 4 where God is on his throne and there's a green emerald rainbow that surrounds the throne and the elders are casting their crowns at the feet of Jesus. And there's thunder and lightning and the angels are singing, holy, holy, holy is the Lord Almighty who was and is and is to come. He deserves the glory and the honor and the power forever. Amen. And I had heard things in this dream and seen things that are described in Revelation 4. And I woke up with my heart racing and grabbed my journal that I keep next to my bed. And I penned down all the lyrics to the sound of heaven in the dark that night. I couldn't even see the page. Over the next couple of days, I spent time just shaping the lines a little better and figuring out what chords I wanted on the piano. A friend of mine helped me fine tune the music and we were able to record and release it that year on my EP. You'll find in the song that there's two main sections of instrumental music and I want you to know that those are there on purpose. I know the song is eight minutes long but I did it intentionally because I, I wanted to allow time and space for you to enter into God's presence and worship him for who he is. So you'll see the beginning of the song is kind of a macro version of, of God and the nations coming together to praise him. And then there's the instrumental for you to worship, um, thinking of that. And then after that, there is um, a verse where it comes down really close and really intimate, where it's just you and Jesus face to face and his hand is on your brow and he tells you that you were worth it to him. There's another instrumental section after that and I did that on purpose for you to have time to just dwell on that thought of how intimate Christ is to you, how close he is. So please know I did that intentionally and I hope that you um, take advantage of that and just use it to worship him. All right, you guys, that's my announcement. Thanks for being here. Be sure to come back October 9th so you can hear the sound of heaven. And this time, as a bonus, I've created a lyric video to go with the song, which will be up on my YouTube also on October 9th. So don't miss it. Until then, take care, stay safe. I love you and God bless.